Hey everybody, it's Marcia, Kansas Misfit, and today I'm going to show you the garden and what's imp what's improved, what's uh, become of it, what's left of it, and uh, see what what there is. So, are you ready? Let's go out to the garden. And this is the kind of weather I like. It's not cold. It's not hot, it's not windy, it's beautiful. Let's come over here to the sweet potatoes. This is the month we get to harvest our sweet potatoes and someone gets $25. Don't forget to get your guess in on how many sweet potatoes is in this stock tank for a chance of winning $25. Wonder how many sweet potatoes we have in this stock tank. Doesn't it look like a little cave in there? Can't really tell through the camera, but yep, it looks like a cave here. I hope we have a lot of sweet potatoes. We didn't get any flowers on the sweet potatoes. Don't know if we're supposed to. Someone says you're supposed to get flowers on your sweet potatoes, but we didn't. From the looks of the Chinese red noodle beans, I think it's just about finished producing. There might be a few, a few stragglers in there, but I think I'm done with it. Now, my pinto beans, I'm looking. There might be a few in here, but not much. There's some still green here. So, I don't know. There might be some. But, oh, I see a few black ones down in here that needs picked. But, if I don't get them picked, they'll fall to the ground and more will grow next year. Which, I really don't want that to happen. Over here is where the corn was. But, I have butternut squash in here. I want to see if they're ready to pick. Come over and see if we can find a butternut squash. There's a butternut squash plant. I believe I already took one off of that. So let's go on the second row here. I'm looking for one. Now I'm looking. There's one. Let's see what it looks like. Well, it looks like it's no good. Waited too long, something got into it. Darn it. Anyway, that's a burnout squash. I can go through this cornfield and finish that up, but I'm not going to waste you guys' time on that. Let's see what's next. Here's the yard long pole beans. And it's still pretty green. There's one right here. It's not really ready to be picked yet. Looks like the chickens are coming over to see me. Hi, Tina. You come over to see Mama? Huh? Yeah, well, we have 15 hens now and two roosters. We got rid of a bunch of our roosters. Someone wanted them. We Sold them for four dollars a piece. Win win situation, if you ask me. Here's the butter beans. I just saw a bumblebee, so I'm gonna be careful. There's bees in here. See, there's one right there. That's a wasp. Got wasps and bumblebees both in here. But I have butter beans. I know I saw a couple big ones here. I'm waiting on that plant to just die and turn brown, and then I can pick pick all the beans off of it. There's one. There's a butter bean right there. There's loofahs in here too. There's a loofah hanging right there. And we'll just let those grow when they die. Then we will have loofahs and I'll take care of the loofahs and the butter beans. Hey Tina. You sure get around fast, don't you? 
Yeah. There's Bernice. There's another Tina. We got several Tinas out there. I just call those board, boardwalks Tina. And the big rooster's name is Fred. And the little rooster's name is Red. Red and Fred. I always tease them. Okay, back to the garden. The first loofah I grew is still pretty green right there. Can't see it very good, but it's in there. We got loofahs. Looks promising. I've already ate some lettuce. I'm picking some lettuce out for dinner tonight. Probably, we'll probably just eat salad for supper tonight because, or dinner, whatever you want to call it, because I want to eat light. I already ate a lot today. We got the eggplants. There's a couple flowers on here. I think we might get maybe one more. Where did I see that? Maybe I didn't. I thought I saw a flower. But that's the eggplant. Of course, we're going to get okra. Hopefully, we still get some more tomatoes. When it gets close to the frost date, I'll be picking all the green tomatoes that we have and making verde. I'll make a video on that. Looky here. I have a zucchini on one of these plants. It's a baby, but it's still... Let me show it to you. I think it's a missing here. Um... So, oh, here it is. See the zucchini? Almost ready to pick. I like them when they're tender like that. Then we got a couple of radishes there that I need to get picked. And then something new on the green beans. Don't know if we're going to get any green beans before the frost hits, but they're getting flowers. See the white flowers? It won't be long. And we'll have green beans. That's what I'm happy about. And then we have these turnips. I thinned out about five or six foot. Anyway. Sounds like my daughter is having fun with her truck. I'm going to have to go. I guess I'll take you over here to my potatoes. I don't know if I need to heal them up some more or not, but I'm not. I'm just going to let them grow. And hopefully we get some potatoes. There's one heel. I planted 12. There's two. I don't see anything here, but there's supposed to be one here. There's one here. There's one here. That's one, two, three, four. Here's number five right here. That's pretty good. One there. And then six. Seven. It's supposed to be twelve. I don't know. But there's the potato hills. Then we'll come over and check out the pumpkins. We got a little, little, little bitty pumpkin there. And then my son in law wants one of these big pumpkins. <gasps> there's a great big one right over here. But I probably won't bother it. So that's probably like one he wants. So. He's not wanting nothing. He's wanting this one over here. So this is the pumpkin he chose to have. Right here. Uh oh, we've got bugs on it. That's the pumpkin he chose to have. Looks nice. Okay, look at this little more of pumpkin. <laughs> okay. We'll come back over here. Got more pumpkins in here. If they ripen up, we'll be able to have some more pumpkin. I don't know where all these bugs are coming from. So many. Never seen so many bugs. There's a pumpkin in here. Look at this one. It's a nice little, ah, I'm falling over. Nice little pumpkin there. And one over there. Yeah. We even have a watermelon plant over here on the corner. Let me see if we can find any watermelons growing on it. We don't know. Let's see. When I'm in the shade, that's when the bugs are worse. See, there's some watermelon right there. Going all the way out to here. 
So, yeah. That's the watermelon. Now, last time I walked through here, this Johnson grass got me in the eye. Uh, I thought I was going to go blind. Because it, my eye was all bloodshot big time. Let me pick these up. I'm supposed to have these up at the house, and I let, I let them down, never, never, never brought them to the house. There's acorn squash. I was trying to get the weeds out of. Don't know if we're going to get any acorns or not. I doubt it. Oh, I see an acorn squash right there. See it? One there. One there. Not enough. But what we get is what we get. I like acorn squash from time to time. That's a couple meals right there anyway. But we have a lot of spaghetti squash. We did. They're in here. I was in here working on the weeds, but they sure keep coming back. Nothing stops it. There's the white one. That's what I was looking for. That big one right there. Yeah. So we got spaghetti squash, acorn squash, butternut squash. Let's see what's next. Well, there's the okra and the eggplant. And that's about it on the garden. I um, we still have green beans promising for a while, as long as it stays nice out. Um, might be a few tomatoes if the tomatoes, if the chickens will stay out of it and stop eating them. So, look, we have some black-eyed peas here. I never showed you. We got some egg, uh, some loofahs hanging in here too. There's one here. There's one there. There's one there. We have a whole bunch of black-eyed peas in here. So there comes my cat. Lots of black-eyed peas. Here comes the 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 star of Kansas Misfits Garden. You like seeing. BBJ in the garden. Give me some hearts for her. Him. For him. He likes he likes being in the garden. And give me some hearts for him. Yeah. Well, that's about it. Hope you guys enjoyed enjoyed the garden tour. Have a good day.